So Apple have recently announced the new iPad, the iPad Pro. But what is it and why should you get it? Hey guys, Travis here from Talk Tech with a new video. Enjoy. So, the first thing I want to mention is that the iPad Pro is going to be announced in uh, November, or released in November for purchase, so it's not actually available yet. Um, I'll just tell you a bit about it now, the specs and stuff. Um, it comes in three colour options, like previous iPads. Silver, gold, and um, space grey. Um, it's funny though because um, you probably also heard the iPhone 6s has just been announced, and it's got a new colour, uh, rose gold, which is not included on this. So the dimensions for the iPad are. 12 inches by 8.68 inches by 6.9 millimeters. Um, so that results in a screen size of 12.9 inches, which is pretty massive. That also probably links back to why it's called iPad Pro. Um, it runs iOS 9, as you probably expect. It's got stereo speakers on each of the corners of the tablet um, you probably expect it's got touch ID and a new thing that Apple hasn't done before they call it the smart connector basically it's just a keyboard dock but um, it's like the Surface 3 and X Sony Xperia tablets have that on um, it's got dual microphones, let's tell you a bit about the display now, um, so it's a 12.9 inch retina display, um, IPS display with 2732 by 2028 pixels. Uh, which is 664 ppi. Um, there's 5.6 million pixels on the display, which I thought was quite um, amazing, really, because you just think 5.6 million little dots. It's quite a few. Um, the display is laminated to the glass. It's got an anti-reflective coating, which was on the iPad Air 2, and a finger-resistant coating. And this is the best Apple's the best screen Apple have ever released in terms of resolution. So let's talk about a bit about the internals. It's got an Apple A9X chip with. 64-bit um, architecture, which Apple claimed to be 1.8 times faster than the iPad Air 2, which is quite a big jump, I suppose, from that. Um, the camera, 8 megapixels on the front, 1.2 megapixels on the back. Uh, the front one has autofocus, f2.4 aperture. 1080p and 1080p video at 30 frames a second and slow mo at 120 frames a second so just like previous iPhones and iPads, and iPads I suppose um, and Apple says it's got a 9 hour battery um, 
so that's all I've got with the specs. So that's some pretty good specs for a tablet. Um, pretty excited to see what this tablet's like. Um, you can get it in three size um, configurations. I don't think I mentioned actually, it weighs three 713 grams, which is pretty heavy, but it is massive. Um, and it comes in Wi-Fi and cellular options, which you'd expect. 120 gigs or 32 gigs, so um, not much of a choice there. But um, I'm pretty excited for this tablet. Um, Apple seem to make it, or they say that yes. So it's good for like stuff like gaming and stuff as you expect, but more um, for like work. Um, I don't know. Um, they do have. They are releasing like a stylus pen, like the Surface Three pen for it. Um, they also say it can handle 4K video editing. Um, so that's so it's obviously pretty powerful, but. I don't know how it'll compare to a computer even with the case, so how it'll work for work, but I'll find out in November. So thanks for watching. Um, if you are new, please subscribe. Um, the channel's doing quite well at the moment. I'd really appreciate it if you did subscribe, or just left a like below, or a comment in the description as well. And please. Check out some of my other videos. Um, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. And remember, talk tech. Thanks.